CBS Sports presents the National Football League. Today, it's the San Francisco 49ers and the Seattle Seahawks. With Tiki Barber and Melanie Collins on the sideline, Kevin Harlan. We've had the flip of the coin. The Niners have won. They will take the second half kickoff. Seahawks will receive. That is D. Jim Dallas, who is awaiting the kickoff from Wisnowski of the Niners, who won three in a row. And away we go in the Pacific Northwest. It's Dallas for Seattle. And out past the 20. It'll be first and 10, and Russell Wilson will take it from there. Hi, everyone. So, Tiki, let's uh, talk about some headlines that have captured your attention heading into this one. Yeah, this has been all about the San Francisco 49ers three-game winning streak, and then running the football. Elijah Mitchell has been fantastic. Debo Samuel has helped a lot in that run game, but he is out today, so Jimmy Garoppolo has a lot more on his shoulders. And Russell Wilson for the Seattle Seahawks, he battled that hand injury, broke his middle finger, had a pen put in it, it took a lot of time to get back but here he is eight weeks now removed from that surgery and he and in his mind he believes that he can overcome it he speaks it he talks about it and you got to believe that he believes it and his team believes it as well there is an injury on the field on the kickoff and it's Trenton Cannon number 49 who caught the knee of his own player Ofunga, yeah. I think, is the one as they intersected, and he's being looked at right now at about the 19-yard line. Tough way to start things off. You can see they're beginning to unravel the medical equipment, and the athletic trainers from both teams are going over there. Russell Wilson, in fact, is making his way over there as well. Tiki, you can... Yeah, this is a tough-looking hit, Kevin. He kind of slid we welcome you to Seattle we just had the opening kickoff to the Seahawks and there's an injury timeout for the Niners and we will step aside on CBS